Farm Basics time today, we're going to talk about how many ears of corn can a combine harvest in a single day? And this kind of goes back to on the farm 100 years ago, let's say, when farmers would literally go hand pick every ear of corn. And even today, there are some contests out there. So if you're great at picking corn ears and you think you can beat everybody else, there are a handful of contests to try to determine who's the fastest in the country. But you know what? An actual working farm today doesn't make any difference because the farmer can't even come close to keeping up with what a combine can do out there. So today we want to run a little bit of math for you and show you how fast these combines can actually move through the field. Okay, first of all, when you hear this number, it's going to be astronomical. It's tremendous how many ears of corn a combine can actually harvest in a single day. And I think about whenever we have kids come out to our farm, we have a lot of kids Kids come out, tour the farm, especially at harvest time. They love to see the equipment running in the field. And the kids, it never fails. They always ask, can I have an ear of corn? And they look at that ear of corn like it's worth several dollars per ear. It's not. It's only worth several cents per ear at best. But still, you think, wow, that's a lot of ears. That must be a lot of dollars. It still doesn't amount to many dollars for farmers, but they can pick a lot of ears in a day. Okay, so we'll just run some simple math to make this easy. Roughly, a farmer in our region of the country plants about 30000 plants per acre okay so it could vary a lot it might be as low as 15,000 it might be as high as 45,000 but let's just use the figure of 30,000 plants per acre okay then you say well how many acres can the farmer harvest in an hour a lot of these good new combines you can pretty easily get over 10 acres an hour and even more than that in some cases but let's just again for easy figuring use 10 acres per hour okay so if I've got 30,000 plants they're gonna provide roughly 30,000 ears. Yes, some of them might have two ears, but there might also be a plant here or there that doesn't have any. So you take 30,000 ears times 10 acres, that's 300,000 ears in the matter of an hour. Now, how good is the fastest you've ever done, Darren? If you've gone through a field and you've tried pulling ears off and shucking those ears, what do you think you could do? Well, about, uh, <laughs> no, I could do about, uh, 20 ears per minute at best. And that would be completely booking it, never ever failing, just snap, throw, snap, throw, snap, throw. 20 sounds that pretty would be, fast. Dear. That would be tremendous. And so if that's 20 per minute, that would be 1,200 per hour, would be about the it's fastest a human slower, could do it. Slightly slower than the 300,000 per hour and that a modern combine can do. And you'd be worn out after doing 1,200 of those, <laughs> right. believe me. Right, whereas uh, you're just enjoying life in your nice combine cab as your combine does these 300,000. And this is the other thing too, recently, we were driving down a gravel road and my son saw an old corn crib. And he goes, what's that? <laughs> and I said, well, Zach, you know what? If you were my grandpa, you wouldn't just say, what's that? You'd be filling that every single fall and in some cases, maybe even by hand. Now, actually, they had these little uh, elevators that would bring it up, but they'd fill these corn cribs with ear corn. I said, we just don't do that anymore. You might find a handful of guys that do that, other than seed production growers, of course, do. But today, what we're doing with that combine is not only picking the ears, we're shelling them off, too. So we're accomplishing two jobs at the same time with that modern combine. So it's a tremendous tool. Yes, it costs a lot. Might even cost more than the house the farmer's living in, but the combine is a tremendous valuable tool and now you can see why. One thing you'd prefer not to run through your combine is our weed of the week. Can you identify this week's weed? 